We would encourage parents to bring their 5 to 11 year old down to get vaccinated at uh, Tipton Sports Academy or any of the other um, vaccination centres. Um, this is so that they are protected themselves from COVID-19 and also protecting other members of the society that may be more vulnerable um, than, than others. The vaccination street came about from lots of inspirations. We were, we knew we were having the five to eleven year olds coming imminently, and we had a long line of just plain white cubicles. Um, so yeah, we just came up with the idea of really brightly coloured pods at first, which then developed into shop fronts and then developed into a whole street for the children to just sort of come along, have a look at. They can run up and down it. They can play, especially whilst parents are having the, the consultation they're doing all the questions they don't have to sit in there they don't have to wait we've always got staff around showing them what's going on letting them draw let them color and then yeah so once they're ready to go it's such a quick process for them and then they're straight back out into the world of vaccination street to play again and it works quite well for them. There's hopscotch for them to play with on the way in because there's no point in keeping kids uh, sitting still because they just won't do it. Um, and then we've got lots of distraction techniques within, it, within the actual vaccination pod. And that's things like bubbles, we've got toys for them to play, dinosaurs, princesses, that sort of thing. Um, and then we, we use reward systems as well. So we've got stickers, we've got uh, tattoos, like temporary tattoos for them. And then after the vaccination uh, period is done, we, what we do is we then bring them out into the games area. So we have giant snakes and ladders. We've got giant uh, Connect Four, uh, 10 pin bowling, although it's a slightly smaller. Um, and then once they've all settled, then they can go on their merry way.